Aloha everyone, welcome to our YouTube channel. My name is Craig. My wife Sarah and I have been performing and traveling ukulele artists and instructors for over 20 years. We use this YouTube channel for our music videos, for a backyard concert series, we have free live workshops, um, as well as a ton of other fun ukulele related things. We also have an online school in partnership with ArtistWorks. Now today we're gonna to do something a little different. We're having our good friend Kale Gamiao, who is one of the world's greatest ukulele players, who is now the CEO of Anui Nui Ukuleles USA. And he's here to showcase some of the new uh, ukuleles that are being released this year. And we thought it'd be fun to have him and kind of showcase some of these new instruments. We hope you enjoy. Aloha everyone. Huge mahalo to both Craig and Sarah for having me here to talk about ukuleles with each and every one of you. Um, thank you guys for all of your support. Please continue to support this wonderful instrument we all love because it's made such a huge difference and impact um, in all of our lives. And that's why I'm here. That's why Craig and Sarah are here today. We wouldn't be here without all, all of your support. So thank you. And before we get into talking about and introducing all these new Anui Anui instruments, um, I just wanted to let you guys know that if any of you are interested in purchasing anything from AnuiNuiUSA.com, use promo code Craig and Sarah 2022 during checkout for an extra 10% off your purchase. If you're living within the USA, you get a free complimentary full setup and free shipping to wherever state you live in. So thank you guys so much and make sure you guys sign up for the Artist Works program. It's gonna help a lot and take your ukulele to the next level. So let's get started. As Craig mentioned earlier, we do have some new instruments from Anui Nui. One of the, or a few of the new instruments comes from a new line called Singer. And the ukulele I have in front of me is one of these ukuleles. These ukuleles were actually inspired by a vintage style of not just building but sound as well. They come in different sunburst colors and also different types of woods. And this is one line that um, visually it's very different from anything that Anui Nui has ever released in the past. And we're looking forward to hopefully even expanding on this line. This line actually starts off at a very affordable price, like around $900. So if any of you are looking for something slightly different, even if you have some of our instruments or you're looking to upgrade from an entry-level ukulele, something like this might be a great instrument for you to check out. And um, we have four different models. This is the Tobacco Sunburst. Um, this is an all-solid mahogany ukulele gloss finish and as you can see it does have a dark to light finish creating this sunburst classic effect and if you look in the back you kind of see that the sunburst theme kind of continues on the neck too this is all solid wood um, they're all outfitted with goto upt planetary tuners and this one in particular has besides the mahogany top back and sides we have a rosewood bridge and fingerboard so let's kind of give this a little sound sample so you guys can get an idea of what you might get to look forward to if any of you guys are interested in an instrument like this it does have a unique voice it's not as bass heavy as the famous moonbirds are which is actually a good thing because not everyone likes that kind of sound with these type of ukuleles what's really cool about it is that if you're going to play with other people, it has enough volume and enough clarity for it to jump out in the front. And overall, I think it would be a, a nice addition um, if you, or like I said earlier, if you're looking for something different.
All right, next up, we have another new model from Anui Nui. This is part of the Singer line, just as the previous ukulele. This one in particular, I think is really cool because this is a solid Hawaiian koa top, back, and sides. And this is the Ice Tea Sunburst, which looks really, really cool. And I've only seen a handful of Sunburst koa ukuleles and this one is probably one of my favorites from the Singer line. Um, as you can see, you can look at the top. It kind of blends in from a little bit of red to some brown and yellows as you get to the center. Just like how an iced tea actually looks like. And we got maple binding along the sides. And as you make your way to the, the back, you can actually see the sunburst even more clearly um, without any distractions from the sound hole and the rosette. It comes with a abalone rosette, mother of pearl, fret dots, um, rosewood face plate, fingerboard, and bridge, bone nut and saddle, Goto UPT tuners. And with all of these features, it comes at an affordable price at 1200 bucks. So um, get them while you can. These are going to be very limited. And we're hoping that you guys love them so we can actually get more in stock. So let us know what you think. Let's give this a little sound sample. All right, so we're back with another singer model from Anui Anui. And this one is probably one of the higher models, I guess, in the line. There's actually four. Um, there's another one that's similar like this called the Lemon Sunburst, which we're actually in the process of getting more of those in stock. This is the famous Cherry Sunburst. And I really like how this one came out. We actually got a few prototypes um, in a while ago and they were still dialing the finish and in fact like this one looks more of what I would imagine a sunburst looking like instead of it being candy apple red in your face super bright it's more on the mellow side kind of reminds me of some older Gibson um, acoustic guitars I'm sure you a lot of you have seen those in like a guitar center or other music shops but this one in particular comes with a build very similar to the Moonburst. The biggest difference is the way they brace. They're braced. So you got Moon Spruce for the top, and you, as you can see, there's a lot going on on this ukulele. We normally don't have this much um, abalone inlays on most of our ukuleles, but this one uh, we'll make an exception for this one because of the type of style we're, we're trying to go for. So we got abalone for the rosette. We have um, binding going around the sides. And as you can kind of see, the fret markers kind of remind you of some of the older vintage uh, Martin um, style of uh, fingerboard inlays. And um, this one, if we make our way to the sides and back, comes with Indian's rose, Indian rosewood, which like I said earlier, is pretty much the same type of wood combination as the UT200 or the Moonbird as we all know it except this one uses more of a traditional fan bracing. So the whole Singer line uses fan bracing while the UT200 or Moonbird line is X bracing. Now just keep in mind that these don't have as much overall like super bassy tones from it, but it's very balanced. So you get a good balance between warm and highs. So regardless of what type of style you play, this ukulele will actually perform as it should. 
always been a big fan of Rosewood and Spruce. And a lot of you know that I, I've played some of my instruments for a number of years with that wood combination and can't go wrong with it. So this is the Cherry Sunburst Singer. Alright, so now we have a very special ukulele. This is a artist's signature model from our good friend in Japan. His name is Kass. I've had the pleasure and honor to tour with him many times. We've been, we actually officially met each other at the Thailand Ukulele Festival in 2011. Since then, we've been great friends. Um, we've gotten to go to Korea together. We've also been to Taiwan. And of course, um, he's, I got to visit his hometown in Japan, which is phenomenal. And what makes this ukulele special is not only does it have the same grade of koa that our UT5Ks do, um, but this has a few other features. So for Kias, the well is a very sentimental and very um, special um, thing for him because it represents where he's from. And in his home hometown, um, it's known as a fishing village, so a lot of people, you know, are constantly fishing. There's fresh fish, like, being brought to the market every single day, which is pretty awesome. And normally we don't have too much of our models decked out like this, but because this is an artist signature model, we had to do something special. If you look down here at the bottom bulb, um, there is a nice well tail inlay that's going on with a bit of, um, I think there is... It's made from ebony and I'm not sure with the, the lighter color, color wood, it looks to be somewhat similar to a maple or okume. And this is the first time I've ever seen a rosette like this. I'm so used to seeing a lot of more traditional abalone style rosettes. Um, some rope bind rope rosettes that I've seen in, in the past too have looked really nice. But if you look at the color theme, you can clearly see that there is a mixture of wood um, and shell materials in here as well. We got the whale theme um, going up the fretboard kind of acting like fret markers as you can see but also on the side I, this is what I love on all my ukuleles I love side dots this is one thing that I gotta have on every single ukulele is side dots it's just so much better when you just gotta look down versus looking over to know where your hands are one of the things that's also really cool is the theme continues up here on the headstock. And then we outfitted them with gold and pearl white Goto UPT planetary tuners. And this is really nice. I think it adds a re really classy touch. But overall, this is very kind of like a UT5K on steroids, as you want to call it. Has the same cutaway and that same um, Mount Fuji X-Brace sound that we all like. So, <laughs> so here's a little sound sample of this gorgeous ukulele.
right, everyone, I have some exciting news. Uh, this is the newly designed and revamped UT1K. So we're going to be relaunching this model with a slight facelift or makeover, as you want to call it. Um, as you can see, um, the body shape and the wood choice is still pretty much the same as the older design. But what's different now is now you actually get binding and a, a maple rosette. And instead of the slotted headstock, we decided to keep the original Moonbird or Anui Nui shape headstock without... Um, it just looks really clean because the slotted headstock, as, as nice as it is, um, we've gotten some feedback from some of you and um, not everyone prefers a slotted headstock. And in fact, it takes longer to change strings on a slotted headstock ukulele than it does with a normal one. Um, not that much longer, maybe just five minutes. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it's a we're happy with the the design and how these came out. You know, they're they're still pretty much affordable um, as far as it being a 100% Hawaiian koa ukulele, and it's it's great. I've always been a big fan of the UT1Ks um, since we first got them in. Um, it's just now. It's a little bit more pleasing to the eye and more attractive um, for those of you who are looking for something with a little bit more aesthetics. So without further ado, let's give this a sound sample. All right, so last but not least, I wanted to showcase this brand new model. It's pretty much an extension of the famous UT200 or Moonbird line of ukuleles. And pretty much everything is made the same as a standard UT200, but on this one, we decided to take it a slight step further and add a little bit more art and more aesthetics, um, something that's more attractive. And I. I do know that some of us do like shiny things, and, <laughs> and I'm, I'm guilty of that too, myself. And this one actually is called the Hummingbird Tenor, and we all know the Moonbird, so now we have the Hummingbird, and as you can see, there are really nice Hummingbird inlays around, on top of the body, the sound hole, or the rosette, and also here at the top of the headstock, we have the hummingbird in place of the typical Anui Nui logo. So if you're looking for, if you're a big fan of the UT200s or the Moonbird line, and you're kind of looking for something with a little bit more sparkle, um, this might be something for you if you guys really do enjoy um, looking at um, inlays and artwork on ukuleles or just instruments in general still has a really nice wide range of overtones it's really rich it's really full it's really bassy with having all that sustained and clarity from the spruce so we're really really happy with these and we're excited to be able to share it with all all of you folks and we're going to be getting these in regularly so this little showcase.
All right, so I hope that you folks enjoyed checking out all these ukuleles and listening to their, their unique voices. Um, don't forget to use promo code Craig and Sarah 2022 for an extra 10% off with complimentary setup and free shipping to anywhere within the USA. Thank you guys so much. It's been a pleasure to be able to be here and share a little bit with all of you. Take care. Aloha. Kalei signing off.